اعتمد كثير من الاعداء على ان for you. The tax collector is due a visit. You must not fly there now, Enkidu.
They are a threat no more. Fly free, Enkidu. Show me the path ahead. Hey, the Jamidis the flies on to two bad. Won't take long! They should be back with the coin. Oh, oh, my head will roll if we do not deliver it. How hard is it to get the coin to increase schools, taxes? Huh? More oh. coin trickling into their oh, hands. Yeah. There I might know. be more information oh. I can find around but here. No partiality. Not even to their own kind. The Daira Termal is almost here. And if I do not get the coin before then... Oh.
What? The taxes have been paid. does not work alone. Someone not from Baghdad controls the strings. There is a scent on the letter. Perfume. Rose with... iron. Hmm. Blockade at the harbor is funded by the coin of the people. I am done here. Nothing else. Roshan and Rebecca will be waiting back at the bureau. Our protocol hidden one returns. Finally. You found the path back. What do you have for us? The one we are looking for is a Dimiyun. Someone out of Baghdad. You are certain? I found proof. They were working with the tax collector and the harbor master. One used the guards to harass and extort coin from the Dimiyun. The other seized goods at the docks. Extortion, I understand. But seizing goods? More objects from these ancient beings they worship. 
They are looking for a rare hairpin imported from the East Road. It will be up for auction at the Da'irat al Mal. An official invitation into the auction. Now, we have a way in. Well done. Our target has to be someone connected to both Al Anga and Al Kululu. Someone working closely with the officials. Informers heard whispers of the Khalifa's treasurer. In recent times, they have been quite involved in the businesses of Kah. Someone like that will no doubt make an appearance at the Da'irat al Mal. We should prepare, so I will scout ahead. Meet me near the souk when you're ready. Not a lot is known about this person. Underestimating your opponent is a fool's folly. Worried? I will tread carefully. I will take good care of it. The plan is simple. Enter the auction as a merchant wishing to bid on exotic artifacts. We know they want the hairpin. And we know they will be at the auction. They already let it slip through their fingers once. When the hairpin appears, I will watch the crowd and make sure to obtain it. That will secure a meeting with this treasurer. I am fully confident they will bid on it. Whatever the cost. Yes. I will gather as much information as I can about this treasurer before the auction starts. For someone in their position, there will be no lack of whispers. The first feather without a head. It is your duty to find the right one. Do not let yourself get distracted. Focus on the mission at hand. It does no one good to linger on things that do not exist. This is real. I understand. Silence is better for the wise, and how much more so for fools. Habban Mubattagan. Do you think we need luck? Thank you. 
There is a rotten Turk, treasurer. Property stolen. Merchants extorted. Foreigners tormented. Corruption is rank and everywhere. But you are at its heart. Even now, your poison spreads along the East Road to lands untouched by the Order's venom. I hear you hunger for a hairpin. One up for auction at the Da'irat al mal I will play the rival for your heart's desire and draw you from the shadows. Lend me your eyes. Refreshing to see the bazaar so lively. The traders only bring in the finest spices I want during the auction. <laughs> Should have known you would be here, Kong. Ha! <laughs> you know me. Come, let us chat. I do. Do you have any information about the treasurer? Someone who works for the Khilafah? The treasurer? Hmm. I do have something, but... You know, it hurts to give precious information for free. What job do you need doing now? Ha! <laughs> Already know what is on my mind, eh? You see, little Finch. The Da'irat al-Mal is not only an important event for the upper class of Kakh, but also for thieves. Did someone take something of yours again? A precious ceramic saucer. Luca has it. He has always been jealous of me. Ah, where do you think it is? I knew I could rely on you, little Finch. You should be able to find it in the crates near his stall. Be right back. Oh, 
Ahlan, Ahlan, come upstairs and look at my work. I assume you heard about the commotion if you stole down. This must be the stall Kong mentioned. Now to find that plate. Trust Kong to hold a plate like this. Now maybe he will tell me what he knows about the treasurer. Hmm. Suspicious activity on the rooftops. Ahlan, Ahlan, come upstairs and look at my words, Ya Sadiqi. Things you've never seen before in Baghdad. Exotic Chinese artifacts. Here only. Nowhere else. Don't be shy. Come closer and be amazed at my selection upstairs. Assalamu alaikum. You mentioned Chinese artifacts. Yes, friend. Welcome, welcome. You will surely find something of interest here. Beautiful threads, smooth as a camel's buttered bottom. A special for you, the Sadiqi. Buy two, get another free. I should look at other wares. Longing for the exquisite, ya Sadiqi? I have ornaments that hail from the Far East on auction. Rare vases, delicate teacups. But the hairpin is my prize. One of a kind, a beauty even the treasurer asked about. Wait, the hairpin? Where is it? It's going to be up for auction. If you wish to purchase it, make sure to bring a good bag of coin. A hairpin from the east? 
This must be the item El Kululu was after for the treasurer. I must look out for it at the auction. Tardiness is not something the treasurer appreciates. I repeat, the treasurer... Not something we can rush, yes, that. The treasurer will not be happy. Neither will I. I know that. The perfume creation is complex. We are already doing our best. Your best is not enough. Come. We talk elsewhere. There are ears in the walls. That woman mentioned the treasurer. I should keep my ears close. The treasurer is fond of the Kina, as you know. No one is more unhappy when three dozen bottles go missing. With the hard work of holding the supply, production has been slow, Yasai Dati. Certain incidents there have also made our situation difficult. You are not telling me exactly what it is we are missing. The... Uh, blood, my lady. The blood is essential in the scent. It is what makes the Hina perfume special. We must have it. I will talk to the Halifa. See what we can do. The treasurer will have to wait for her supply. This perfume? On the tax collector's letters? I thought it smelt like iron. Was it blood? This woman could be from the Khalifa's inner circle. She knows the treasurer. I must speak to her. Oh. Assalamu alaikum, ya Sayyidati. Wa alaikum assalam. I could not help but overhear, Sayyidati, about the perfume. It is not courteous to eavesdrop. Seeing as you are an admirer, you are pardoned. My name is Kabicha, the woman behind the Kina. It has a unique scent. Rose, honey, sandalwood. And if you heard, a sliver of blood. Blood? I should have guessed. I had thought it might be iron. Blood is born from iron, is it not? But, because of that detail, it proves difficult to bring in large quantities. If it is so exclusive, it must be popular amongst officials. I think I caught a scent of it near the treasurer. Ning uses the Kina. She is quite taken with its rich mystique, as are many. Curious. You do not look like one who is interested in the art of perfumery. It is unwise to judge someone by how they look. Indeed. Did I not catch your name? Basim. Basim. I must not waste any more of your time. I wish you a wonderful time at the Da'irat al-Mal, ya Sayyidati. So, the treasurer is a she, and her name is Ning. Here, Little Finch delivers once again. Just the very thing I need to complete my set. I thought this was yours. It is now. Anyway, listen close. I was having my usual afternoon tea when I overheard two ladies speaking about an order they fulfilled for the Dayadat al-Mal. 
They made a beautiful rope for the treasure with intricate eastern embroidery. Open your eyes to that! Eastern wear. Thank you, Kong. The treasurer is likely a foreigner from the east. The auction should be starting soon. مرحبا السلام عليكم ياساس نيحاو هلو it is the time of year again to fulfill your deepest yearning, to listen to your heart's desire, and purchase what God has shown us. It brings me great joy to welcome all of you esteemed individuals to our annual Dairat al -Mal. First on our exclusive, captivating list of exotic odds and ends, we have a stunning statue from India. Made of ivory and crafted by the finest artisans, it will be a perfect addition to any home. Oh, mm. what do we have? One bidder already? No, two. Calling once, twice, a third. Would anyone like to best that price? No? So, this piece goes to the lovely lady. Next, we have a one-of-a-kind ethereal beauty. This hairpin hails from the east. And look at the detail on the dragon. Perfect as a collectible, and even better as a gift for a certain lady friend you might have. So, so what is this piece worth to you, Ya Azdekhai? One, for the treasurer who graced us with her presence. Ning. The treasurer. Two. Any others? Hmm. We have a hmm. third there. Oh, two owns it again. Number three. What will you do? How much do you want this, my friends? Reach into your heart. Listen to your desire. Hmm. No one? Then sold to the handsome bearded man. This hairpin belongs to you now, Sayyidi. Now, for the third item. And we thank you once again for making the Dairatul Mal a success. May your purses be ever full and your heart ever longing. Did you see her? Calmness and grace. Like a rope. If only I could speak to her. All members of the merchant guild can arrange an audience in her chamber. You call her. Well, maybe. I have an appointment with the treasurer. Move aside. Apologies. My instructions were clear. No brooch, no entry. Do you know who I am? I need to speak to the treasurer. I was called. Summon. Assalamu alaikum. I'm here to see the treasurer. On what business? I have a gift for the treasurer, if she will see me. Only members of the ivory coin are allowed to enter. No brooch, no entry.
علي تذكر الإجابة سأفكر في الأمر مليا لا أعدك بأنني سأفلها some of those pale killed a couple of them. they are wild but still hey what what 
I'll finish you! This is proof that I am of the Merchant's Guild! Look! See? With respect, that does not entitle you to three bags of saffron, two of vanilla, and a bottle of honey without a single coin. Impossible! Bah! This is a waste of my time! Hello! Spices for you? Trouble with customers? No more than usual. These people from the Ivory Coin think themselves touched by God himself. The Ivory... I... I should not speak about it. I do not know much, really. Whatever you know can help me. Well, it will not hurt to tell you what I know. The Ivory Coin is an exclusive merchant's guild. They have a brooch that grants access to certain places. How do you obtain this brooch? I hear only respected merchants are part of the ivory coin, and that you can only be invited by another member. They think their status gives them permission to take goods without coin. <laughs> Have you ever seen such vanity? This is expected in Karch. Thank you.
No brooch, no entry. You know how this works. Yes, but I left my brooch in there. Do you not see the problem here? No brooch, no entry. Best to get them right by the Nahadishla before they take the taste of the tanneries. I still can't believe you might fall that. An exclusive union for the merchants of high society. I should have expected this to exist. The Chamber of Antiquities is the treasurer's haven. I need to find a way in. <laughs> <laughs> 